Welcome back to another video and in this video today we are going to be covering one of the rare fragrances uh, that's going to be coming. You know, I had talks about it being discontinued. So if you want to find out what that fragrance is, stick around. Yo, what's up everybody? Bobby here and welcome to the Twilly's Two Cents channel. And please go ahead and subscribe and click the notification bell because now you will be alerted when I get to upload new content for you guys and your support is always appreciated. So let's hop into the video. So of course you already seen the title of this video. You already know what fragrance we're talking about. I don't even know why I said that. But anyway, it's going to be coming from the house of YSL and that is Long Old Team. So, like I said about this fragrance, I know that this one had talks of being discontinued. I don't know whether it is or there isn't. Haven't really looked too much into it. But what I do know is that you won't be able to find this one in stores. You have to get it offline. And hopefully you can catch it when it's in stock. But I have it here so I can talk about it with you guys today. Long Old Team is a woody floral musk fragrance. It was created by Anne Flippo, Dominique Ropion, and Juliet Kazuka <laughs> I bet. Whatever I'm not gonna I butchered it, okay? But it'll be at the bottom of the screen because I feel so bad about trying to even say that man. I gotta put it on the screen. So yeah, that's the other person that had a hand in making this fragrance. That was so disrespectful. I'm sorry, Juliet. I apologize. When it comes to what notes are in this fragrance right here, we have up top ginger, grapefruit, cardamom, and bergamot. In the mid, we have rose, sage, geranium, and apple. In the base notes, we have cedar, vetiver, and cashmere wood. So with starting off 2022 I know I wanted to prepare myself to have some fragrances for the spring and summertime and what better one to try out than this one this has been one that this has been one that I wanted to add to my collection for a while never did but finally I got it and I am happy with it and I'm gonna let you know what I really get from this one. so with this fragrance right here I really pick up on that apple the ginger the rose and the grapefruit very fresh and invigorating I would say that this fragrance is very lively. Something that will shine and sparkle in the summer and springtime. This is a unique fresh sheet that I'm pretty sure I will put a pretty big dent in this one. Might want to be careful because I know how it is with finding this one. But like I said, if you got it, man, you definitely want to go for this one in the spring and summertime. This one here has a bit of a kick, so when it comes to longevity, you can expect some great, uh, especially when you get that first initial spray, those first few hours, you're gonna uh, smell amazing. This one is gonna pop off the skin. And then I will say this one becomes a skin scent when you get close to that uh, six hour mark. So six to eight, probably like more skin scent-ish, but like, man, the initial spray, you're gonna smell amazing for those first few hours. When it comes to sea eyes, people can pick this one up a little bit more than the arm's length. Like I said, with the freshness that's in this one, it's going to be able to project a bit more. And then the citruses that you have in this one, you're going to be able to capture the noses of who's surrounding you. This, I say the elegance comes in with the rose that's in here. You know that, of course, the ginger grapefruit keeps it fresh. And you get a bit, a bit of sweetness. You got some cardamom and apple and the um, and the cashmere wood so i think that long oil team to me and my nose and since i've started doing reviews this has has to be one of the first ones where i smelled it and i just instantly started naming off things so for instance this is what i mean fresh bright zesty you can tell that's coming from that ginger. Man, the rose, you can tell that that's in there as well, giving it the elegance, like I said previously. The grapefruit, just everything on top of those woods, the cashmere wood to smooth it out. I would say this is, you know, a quite a wonderful one that smells unique and it's one that 
you will probably definitely not forget about if you have this one in your collection. So when it comes to the presentation of this fragrance, you have this wonderful shaped top, cylindrical glass bottle, you know, one that really stands out in your collection. Love the presentation. So when it comes to giving YSL long or team a rating, I have to give this one right here a 9.2 out of 10. Very solid. You know very fresh invigorating this is going to liven up your day hope you enjoyed the video that's all i got to say about this one catch you in the next one peace hope you guys enjoyed the video if you haven't subscribed yet please go ahead and subscribe click the notification bell and if you enjoyed the video also leave me a like or dislike drop some comments you know stuff like that and also check out one of these videos